Philip brought us here for a reason. Why was that, Andrew? <laughs> right, a, a piece of paper, shipment invoice, hundreds of stealth boys sent here a, a long time ago. But stealth boys must be in the one room, one we don't search yet, the one we can't search. Of course. Yep. Yes, Antler says we Super. Let we get the key. And I don't know what you were doing, Boone, but... Are you shooting at something? What's he shooting at? Oh, there it is. Oh, the jailer? Why did he pop up here already? That doesn't make any... Why is the jailer up here? Bastard. He doesn't even... He's got the jail key, yippee freaking do that. Yeah, I'm just gonna kill all of them in here. Um... Where are you guys going? <laughs> okay, I'm gonna turn them back off from aggressive. This game is ridiculous. They're running off and killing these things. Which I mean, it's great and all, but. Okay. No, you come here. Come here. I'll it. follow your lead. Thank you. Where the fuck is Eddie? Eddie. Eddie. He's unconscious. I can hear crazy boy. Where the fuck is Eddie? Oh. Why can I hear uh, Davison? Did we already piss Davison off? God damn, we're still not getting anything. It's pissing me off. You. Be passive. Okay, so aggressive makes them chase everything around pointlessly. That's great. Fucking assholes. Well, so the jailer decided to pop out early and killed me, or try, and he failed. Um, I wonder if. If I go find her now, will, will that. Will that do the quest for me? I don't know. Um, I'm trying to do this quest as fast as possible, but. Didn't even get any stealth boys. The jailer always has a stealth boy. Always. It does in 360. Yeah. Chick there. Oh no. Um, basically, there's a ghoul up ahead that uh, wants us to find the buy we just found. And yeah, so I found it. Hopefully, I'll be able to just tell him straight off that I already know where she's at. And there should be another. There should be another Nikon around here somewhere. Uh, besides Davidson, of course. I really don't want to kill Davidson, but you kind of have to now. If you kill everybody else in here, he gets pissy at you. Not sure why. All these bodies everywhere. Just, just. Uh, trying to figure out where I'm at. There we go. Okay. So you guys are still with me? Good. Good. Come and get it, you big dumb. Hey, you're not one of those things out there. No, I'm not. Who the hell are you? Jason sent me down here to get rid of the demons. And I bet he told you it's the creator's will for you to risk your ass instead of him, right? Yep. Well, good luck with that. I give you a hand, but no thanks. I may look like a corpse, but I'm partial to living. You don't look like the other ghouls from Bright's group. Guess the outfit gives that away, huh? I never did buy into that religious mumbo jumbo with the robes and all that shit. It gets lonely up in the wastes, okay? And I don't have to tell you, 
That Bright's group has got some fine looking goulettes in it. Uh, or maybe I would have to tell you. Goulettes. Anyway, I helped them out. And they kept me supplied with ammo and pleasant company. What do you drop down here? First off, I'm not trapped. <laughs> this was a tactical choice, all right? I'm no match for those things out there. So I found a good defensive position, and I've been defending it, right? Oh, who am I fooling? I'm trapped. Name's Harlan. Pleased to meet you. What happened was, I was escorting folks down to work when those things attacked us. Most of the fight was upstairs, but some folks panicked and made for the basement. Of course. And I went after them. Well, turns out there were even more of those bastards down here than upstairs. And things went to shit fast. I couldn't find the others. So I fell back to this room. Set up a nice little kill zone. End of story. Hmm. I'm gonna help you get out of this room. Huh. Well, you're polite. I'll give you the... I had a... He's got a friend, I know. You... I did find her, unfortunately. I see. You did... Alright, there we go. I really don't feel like listening to him. Honestly, Todd, I'm sorry. Uh, oh wait, no, you have a stealth boy. There we go. There's one stealth boy for the night. That'll work. And can I disarm you yet? Eh. Damn it. What is my repair at? I swear to God, if it. Of course. Two more points of that fucking thing. Alright, so let's, uh. Let's get ready. Um. You can't really talk to him at all, he just gets pissy. You d I know. This gun is not that useful. Always. Don't want to use that. That'll work. There we go. Alright, it's dead. Uh, bumper sword's always cool. Right. Night are gone. We only got one self boy out of it, but I think we only have like five of those right now. Three? Could have sworn we have more, I don't know. Maybe I'll just maybe I'm thinking the 360 version again. Ugh, it's all mum it's all it's all up there, I don't know. I'm crazed here. Uh so let's keep going. Sadly we did not level up, but uh, again, I could just use the little uh, thingy ma bobber to do it if I need to, which looks like I'm gonna have to. Um, disappointing, but yeah, whatever. It'll work. I hate these fucking stairs. Let's head on in. Alright, never mind. We're not even close to the end yet. Alright, this guy. Randomly pops out of nowhere. Hey there. Is the way clear? Demons are gone. Praise the Creator and bless you, Wanderer. I hope you will come. Yeah, we still have a little bit more to do. So we're gonna follow these guys on out. Uh, basically, what we gotta do now is. There we go. I'm just gonna do another quick save. Uh, basically now we need to get uh, a couple of things for them. Nothing too difficult. Yeah, let me tell you though, this quest took me so goddamn long the first time. I remember the first time I did this, this let's play, uh, I was doing it blind. Completely blind. Um, hell, I used uh, Rooster Teeth's Achievement Hunter video for this quest and even then it was long and I almost forgot which way I was going. Hello, Amster. And down we go. Long point of sway, really. This quest really isn't all that hard, though. Because um, to be fair, uh, if, if you don't want to kill anybody, because, like, uh, when I got the game on 360 for the first time, I know Mike went through and just killed everybody in this place. He just went through and killed all the Nightkin, you know, simple stuff. 
Not me. I use speech. Why? Because it's very easy. That room looks pointless. It's very easy because you, uh, you can just talk your way out of everything and no one dies. Um, makes this quest much, much quicker. I waited to speak with you one last time before I descended to the launch pad, Wanderer. I want you to know that we will remember for all eternity how you delivered us to the threshold of the Great Journey. Sure. Our preparations are nearly complete, but the rockets that will carry us to salvation are yet missing vital components. If you would still help us, one, there is no way that we can thank you enough. It's just going to go. You're seriously going to make your great journey on those rockets? Yes. The rockets will convey us to our promised land in the far beyond. Oh, don't worry, you're going to go far beyond. Let's talk about Chris. After all that you have done for us, I suppose you deserve to. Yeah. We when Chris out. came to us, we tried to convince him that he was human. But this only angered him. He seemed lost. We decided to let him stay with us for a few days, over the course of which we learned that his technical skills far surpassed our own. Yeah, pretty much. Um, it Goodbye. So yeah, Jason actually does think he is one of them, and he is apparently amazing with rockets. Jason right says that I am to cooperate. Yes. How can I help? Need, two th need to get two things. As so for the thrust, uh, I get the igniting agent. Just need to go. Let so I already know where to get all the stuff, obviously. So this should be very quick. Um, and first heads up, this thing you have to climb the ladder down below first to even get the thing to open. If you um, if you go here before you go up it, then it, it's locked. You can't open it at all. It's very annoying. Um, so first thing we have to do is make sure you can go to uh, a different place real quick so I can have it, so I can fast travel to it when I need to. Um, I, I, I cannot stand this quest. The ending is great. If you can crash the rockets, the ending is fucking hilarious. It really is. It's worth it. It's worth it. But uh. But honestly, this quest alone would make me would make me not want to play the game after a while. I guess it's just I don't know. It's just it seems pointless, really. So I was like, oh, I want you to get rid of ghouls, and so you do all this crap, and, and then you finally realize that hey, you know, I just spent an hour or whatever on this pointless fucking quest. It's like you just you completely forget about what your main quest is, which I guess can be good for this game, but. But yeah, we're gonna head here, because we do have to come here, uh, for the second part of this quest. So, I'm always good to have it on the marker, on the map, whatever. And there we go. No, just fast travel, so we don't have to spend a minute or so walking back. And we gotta head this way now. I don't think we're, we're, probably won't meet any resistance, so that's too difficult. See, I, now, see, I can't wait to play Old World Blues because it's completely new to me. Like, I've seen the beginning, um, but not too much of it. I watched uh, DSPs only because he's the only person I could find that had, like, the full thing up already, like, instantly. Um, and, good lord, he spent, like, a good five five videos or so straight, just talking to the robots. Now, quick thing I want to mention, uh, the